Well, hello, I'm Laura Schwartz, and welcome to the Bloggers Lounge at the Democratic National Convention. I'm here with the director of the Bloggers Lounge, Aaron Myers. Aaron, I want to ask you, how long have you been working at this project, which is unprecedented for a national convention? I've been working on this since the end of February. Uh, we've been taking applications even before that. Uh, there are a lot of folks who wanted to be here. This is a, uh, it's an historic uh, convention. We always knew it would be. And, uh, you know, this year, this year is the culmination of something that started last year, which was, uh, you know, asking folks uh, if they were interested in being here. Now we have several hundred of them who are, and uh, we're happy to see them. What were the qualifications that they had to meet in order to be able to be a part of the Bloggers Lounge, which obviously is inside the arena, they need a special credential and special access? Well, it's just like the, the, the rest of the media when they uh, are making plans to attend the convention. Uh, they certainly go through a, a planning process, and, and they make sure that they have... Uh, you know, they've met certain criteria that they're able to, to demonstrate that they have a, an active media organization, and that's what we have here. We're, we're certainly looking at uh, blogs as media this year, and I think you can see that these guys are busy at work uh, doing some of the same things you are. Okay, now i got to ask you, because there have been some polls done in the past, and we know about polls. They're never quite accurate. Sure. They say some Democrats are more likely to be Mac users than Republicans. What are you finding here, Mac or PC? I think overwhelmingly people are using Macs in here. So. <laughs> and I see you've got the iPhone and everything. Well, expanding our view here in the Bloggers Lounge, we've got Yelena. And Yelena, tell us where you're from and the name of your blog, please. I'm a Colorado native, born and raised, and I work for Disaboom.com, which is the largest social networking website focusing on the disability community. I write for the Disabled Political blog. Now, are you the first blog that's focusing on politics and disabilities and, and the impact one has on each other? Well, no, there's a large disability civil rights movement and many of the people within the movement blog. However, we're the largest site doing this, and we were just informed yesterday that our political coverage of the 2008 elections has actually been selected to be archived in the Library of Congress. Our next blogger is Gina McCauley from Austin, Texas. Now, Gina's blogging at two blogs here at the convention. The first one, which sounds really interesting is called whataboutourdaughters.com. Tell us about your blog, Gina. Um, my blog, What About Our Daughters, is a blog about black women and girls from a black woman's perspective, and we typically do advocacy work um, in defense of black women and girls. We have a nice, large audience, and then we also have a spinoff blog called Michelle Obama Watch just to deal with um, issues and concerns related to Michelle Obama. And when did you put your blog together? Was that just this year? Was it at the start of the campaign? No, I've been at What About Our Daughters for over a year. Michelle Obama Watch, I think we started right at the end of the close of the Primaries. Well, how, what was your what was your usership when you first started out, and, and have you seen an increase since you've been here at the convention? Yeah, on Mich Michelle Obama Watch, we've gone up probably six times normal readership, wow. and what about our daughters? It's, I don't know, it's up about double. Well, I see you have something called Site Gina. This looks like a really neat uh, site that you're right at you right now called Site Meter. You can track the coverage. You can see. It's going up through the roof. Great, because the, the first day of the convention would have been Monday the 25th, the night of Michelle Obama's speech, mm -hmm. and, and then Hillary yeah. Clinton. And then it went up there. So whether you're here in Denver, in this room, or you're out and around the country or the world, you too can log on and be a part of the Democratic National Convention via the Internet. For CBSNews.com, I'm Laura Schwartz.